How is it going, YouTube? It is your, uh... Yeah, I don't know. What, I don't even, what the fuck am I, what am I supposed to say? This is your super awesome friend from the internet. Let's get right down to the nose. It's type QQ with his poop sniffing. I don't, what am I, poop sniffing, poop sniffing diaries with bullet soul part five million. Uh, you know what? Today's been a bad day for me outside this game. So I've had a few and then I thought, fuck it, let's play bullet souls drunk. Am I going to say fixing everything in your life? Wait, should I say the, the solution to fixing everything in your life is alcohol? Yes. Because because no matter what you do anyway, you're going to die. So you might as well just find any way to fix anything, whether it's self-destructive or not, because ultimately it doesn't matter. You think if I wanted to be healthy and deal with my personal issues in a more productive way, it would keep me out of a coffin? No, not, not really. Not eventually. Inevitably, I'm going in that coffin. So... Inevitably, these beers are going in my stomach. And, and, and uh, inevitably, we're going to beat this fucking game. And you know what's kind of funny? As I'm rambling on, I didn't have high expectations for this, for this run. I thought I was going to just, you know, uh, lose my three lives right here on the first stage. Um, but I had a fucking wild case of fucking drunken master here. Um... Almost to the point where it fucking upset me. Where I, you know, heaven forbid, I've made a mistake in my life and, and drank too much. And then played video games. Because we, you know, you know, stick with me. Don't click off already. We don't die in the first stage. In fact, we almost beat the fucking game. Can you believe it? We played so fucking shitty, sober, that all we need is a little bit of the devil juice. <laughs> and we fucking nearly beat the stupid fucking game. Can you believe it? If I was only sober, if I only fucking snapped out of it this last fucking two minutes of the fucking game, I could have dodged something. And then and then beat this fucking game. And then it had at least some positive mark on the day. Although I guess this is still going to be a positive mark on the day. Just not as positive a mark of a day that I really would have wanted. We just come very... Very... Very close to one seeing this stupid game. Um, so I think... Um, once we push through this numbness and this drunkardness, we might beat this game. There's level one. Down in the gutter. Who cares? No miss, bomb bonus. That's fabulous. Actually, we'll even discuss it, discuss it now. I get two one-ups. Can you fucking believe it? Can you believe it? It's like I'm a fucking... I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know how to explain it. I don't know how to explain it when we play really bad. I don't know how to explain it when we play really good. Okay? Especially where, you know, my fingers are uh, a fraction of a second delayed from my brain. So how the fuck are we dodging anything? But... But uh, wait, let's all watch this run together for the first time, because I don't, I barely remember. It'll be interesting to see how how I fucking pull it off, because I don't know how I did. It'll be a surprise. Do we do we beat the level? Do we beat this game? I don't know. I didn't think I did, but it was such a long time ago. At least I don't know four minutes ago. So who knows? We'll, we'll watch and find out. We might just cut the. We just might have to edit out this commentary when I find out I beat this stupid game. It'll be a nice surprise if I did. I, I thought I uh, I thought I didn't, but maybe I just blacked out and got to the credits. Jesus took the wheel. I was playing bullet bolt souls on the beach, barefoot, and then I noticed footsteps in the beach, and there it was, Jesus naked, with a fucking nine and a half long dick. 
semi-erect, and he picked me up and uh, beat Bullet Souls for me. He said, Type QQ, you worthless sack of shit, I'll help you through this game. Because you're so miserable, a fuck you can't do it on yourself. And he beat it for me while I was passed out on the beach. Because he's a swell guy like that. Did I ever tell you... Have I told you about Jesus before and how fucking cool the guy is? And apparently how hung? He's pretty fucking hung. You know? And why wouldn't he? Jesus is... Well, no, he's not Jesus' son. He's Jesus. He's God's son. Why would, why would God's son not make his son just fucking with a giant, you know, meat hammer between his legs, huh? If there was one person to really get that sort of John Holmes penis, do you, thought, do you think it was... You think it was Jesus? I think it was, you know? You know? How else is he gonna shepherd anybody if, unless he has that big meat cane, right? Right! Have we got- have we sunk further enough in this video? Have we- have- Have- have we, uh, have we been vulgar and obscene enough? We still have a ways to go, I think. Christ Almighty, we've got 24 minutes left. We'll ne we're never going to make it that far. We are never. We're not going to make it that far. That far. It's already gone. It's already gone tits up. Clock out, everyone. Show's over. Click it over. Show's over. Thanks for joining me next time uh, when we play um, Bullet Soul. Till next time. Thank you. And go fuck yourself. Oh, I think I already fucked it up. Did you see how I dodged into that bomb? I was like, oh shit, it's a bomb. And I dodged right into it, but luckily it was a bomb, not a bullet. And that's when I know things were really bad. I was like, oh shit, this ain't gonna go so well, but... It goes so well. Wouldn't you know it? How, how would anyone ever predict it goes so well? I mean, not really well. I can't be too proud. But I certainly exceeded expectations, which were um, lacking. I don't know how do you how do you explain no expectation and then beating it? I had really no expectation, and then I beat it. I suppose that's the best way to ex explain what I just wanted to explain. I suppose that's it. There we go. At least sober and drunk, I cannot beat this last pattern of this boss without at least ta losing one bomb so there's some consistency there and here we are <coughs> that's for you game bound you fucks a little burp for you maybe a little maybe a throw up right right, right down the front of me cuz i'm i'm a role model So here we are, stage three. When we, when it starts to get a little tougher, hug that meat shield centipede asshole. Put him down. Good work, me. But be mindful. See, I'm mean, almost fucking just walked into that shit there. But I was gonna say, be mindful of purple fucker over here. He's gonna come up and he's gonna try to hit you. I hope you know he's coming. Where is he? There he is! Take his shit down! Put him down. Downtown! There you go. Good work, me. You didn't fuck it up. This is me from the future telling you you didn't fuck it up. Past me. In the past. I wish past me could tell me that whether or not we fucking beat this game. I forgot. It was too long ago. But it was, you know, it's such a shame. I think... I think this was the go. This was the this was the run. This was the magic number. I had say I I either had Satan or Jesus. I forget. Someone was with me at the beach. 
Someone picked me up and I saw their footsteps and they beat bullet souls for me. Maybe it was Satan. Maybe it was Jesus. I was blackout drunk, so I don't remember. But I wish they would... What was the point I was making? I wish they would tell me. Was that the point I was making? I don't remember the point I was making. Oh, I kind of wish I wasn't drunk. Because then I could have beat the stupid game. And yes, if you need to know, like, drunk at, like, 6.30 in the evening. So, you know, at least it's better than 9.30 in the morning. How about that? No, uh, work ha was ex exceptionally shitty today. Um, and I think uh, between myself and the whole crew that uh, the building in which I work at is luckily lucky not to be, you know, a burning heap of nails and boards as we speak right now. The fact that, that that place is not being hosed down by the local fire department is a miracle and, and, and just testament to how merciful um, Jesus slash God slash Satan are as just uh, the Holy Trinity. That's that's right. That's the, the, the three, right? If you're Catholic, it's, uh, it's God, Jesus, uh, and Satan. Satan is the... Uh, the, the third brother who, who who kind of fell off the wagon he's dealing with alcoholism he's he's a big shame to the family um, but we still love him we we wish him the best but he's kind of the family fuck up you know you know you have that uncle or that brother or that or you're that fuck up in that case you know you have a mirror and shame and no matter how much you wash you know how have how much you scrub it doesn't come off maybe you're maybe you're the satan in your family give it some thought <laughs> give it think about it maybe you are maybe you're the the third of the third wheel there's our um yeah there's our first one up right there and not too fucking shabby we have that thing protected you know, a feat we couldn't do sober. How about that? And to tell you the truth, I don't. I, I haven't even watched this. I can't even. I can't even follow the video. I wish I could explain what I'm doing, but it, it, it's it's really on autopilot right now. See, as, as, I, as I try to fly and grab that bomb and miss a couple times. We get hit there, though. So ho hopefully we keep this bomb rather health healthy as long as we can. I'm here watching, like, intently as much as you are. Like, holy shit. Is he gonna get hit? I don't remember getting hit. Maybe I'm gonna get hit. I don't know. I don't know, dude. Come big, big wave of bullets, guys. Shoot that shit down before it hits you. But overall, it looks like it's pretty easy. You know, it looks like we're dealing enough damage to them so the bullet patterns don't get too wild and crazy. And just really adding adding the uh, adding the the addition things together. What do we add together? Oh, we took some damage there. What do you add together in a game anyway? Some pretty aggressive play there and what i actually noticed here as well is that near the bottom of the screen that big purple wave that usually kicks us up around the top it actually spreads out quite a lot so i wonder if that's going to be a strategy we we work, work with <coughs> moving forward fuck you game bound with your fucking burps you losers 
You losers getting your fucking 50 subs a day. Go fuck yourselves, you losers. You suck at Isaac. No, they're cool. In fact, they're so cool, I would even suggest saying that you should just stop this video right now. I don't give a fuck. And, and go check out their Patreon. The link should be somewhere in their YouTube account. Or webpage. I don't know. If you want to hack into their account, I'm sure it's going to be there too. But you can probably don't. You don't need to. The information will probably be public, public knowledge somewhere on their page. So, you know, uh, yeah, save the encryption devices. Uh, for, uh, I don't know, the White House or something. I don't know. Is that the cool thing to do now is hack elections? Do that. Do that instead. That's 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 probably funnier in a, in a sicker way. You can just probably click on something on the uh, About tab on, on the uh, uh, GameBound YouTube page. And check out their uh, their Patreon. I, I, I would say... Um, yeah, get on board all that. Those are they're good dudes, and they're trying very hard. And they would never, ever record stuff fucked up, and then do commentary fucked up. They're not a careless asshole, or, or not even careless, a callous, a callous asshole like me. I don't care what the fuck I'm saying. I nearly didn't care about the run, except for the fact when it got good, or at least better. Better than shit. Better than shit, it's good. But, uh... Yeah. Our best friend took a fucking bomb from us. What a dick. Little drink of water. Rehydrate myself. Probably a good idea. And this is a series in the, in the level that's always been a motherfucker. And they're, they're going to take that free life from us right there, unfortunately. Um... Yeah, pretty unfortunate. I wish it. I wish we could have held on to it a little bit longer. But it's not a terribly uncommon place that we have trouble with. Hope to do good here. Got a hit. But overall, doing adequately, I suppose. Not perfect, not good, but uh, I mean, adequately. We're doing about as good as a drunken master should in this game. I'm not even not, not even capitalizing on the or 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 even uh, using the the term master as it really should be intended. Just a uh, drunken slob. How about that? How about that instead? I think that's more more accurate. We're imploring some real aggressive play in this level. It's a, yeah, a level really full of a lot of guys that can take some hits. So I think maybe uh, that's kind of how you play it. You get in there tight with some concentration laser stuff. Try to eliminate them as quick as possible. The road of death. What a motherfuck. I remember this thing hit me still. Well, it wasn't the road part. It was just that purple purple bullet in the middle. But yeah, it was like, without fail, we're, we're seeing that, like, some areas are just always going to... 
always have a way of doing something to prove the point I was going to make, but forgot. How about that? Not the biggest fan of this pattern. I actually, and I pretty much timed that exactly. Yeah, this is probably one of the one of the uh, patterns in the game that I dislike the most. Um, just different speeds. The different speeds things. Those fuck me up so bad. You know, if everything could just be orderly, uh, organized, and orderly, that would be amazing and probably easy. How about that? Could, could this game just be easy? I'd like for like this game to just be easy. Just don't even shoot. Don't shoot. Just let me pound you down. Pound you up. And, uh... Just be done with it. Just be done with this shit. How far... We... God damn. We got 20 minutes. We, got, we still got like 10 minutes left. There's nothing in the world that I could talk about more. Talk about anymore. As as I can't even finish that sentence correctly, you know, that's that's just that's just proof proof right there. I don't know, we talked about hockey last time. We can talk about hockey again. I think game seven between uh the Washington Caps and the Pittsburgh Penguins, I, I guess. I don't have an insult this time. Nothing that I feel confident enough in saying. And then game seven of that's tonight. I should probably check and see. Uh, maybe even started right now. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I should watch. But uh, Ottawa, they took down the Rangers. Good. Good. Fuck you, New York. Right in the dumpster with you. How are the uh, how are the golf fields? Golf fields? Golf maybe golf courses. How are the golf fields in New York, you dummies? As I say, using the wrong word to describe something. Well, here we are at the last level. Um, getting hit a little here and there, but overall, I mean, we're, we're sitting at a... technically five hits at this time you know we got two bombs in this life three on the on our final one so it's five hits but like I was saying before I believe we score um, another extend I'm looking at the uh, score, and I wonder if it's at 12. Because I think we we got one at 6 mil, so it only makes sense at 12 we get another one. I don't know. I was, I was kind of in a blackout state during this part. I had entered the Matrix. I have jacked in. And I was one with the video game. Oh, we're at 11 there. There we go. We got... We got another uh, bomb back. Fuck you, mini-boss. A good little uh, strategy is to take out the, the those little brackets that hold that plate up. So you don't necessarily have to kill the guys on top of it, just sink it. 
which I'm sure you could actually do accidentally a, a few times too before you actually discover it's actually a good idea to do that regardless. There's uh, those two pieces gone, those two pieces done, done and gone. Got hit again. But you know what? We're sitting at four hits. Real close to that 12 mil. I don't, I, yeah, I wonder really what scored us all those points. It's quite bizarre. You know, it's, we, we've, been, we've come to these at this, this point in the game before. So, I, there, yep, there it is, 12 mil. The 12 mil is the, the magic number. God. Not that I do myself any favors, but it looks like we're we have uh, seven hits. Technically, if we reach the boss, it will be eight. And man, that does feel like a big number. You know, you figure at this point in the game, you know, eight hits would be enough. But you know, we haven't seen the final boss enough, and there are a couple patterns. Ooh, there goes that that free man. A little unfortunate. That kind of sucked. Ooh, that was messy. I think if I waited just a fraction of a second there, we could have we could have saved that hit. But yeah, so we got six hits um, on this on this boss. Um, And we do pretty good. I uh, we, we take him down quite a quite a bit. I get pretty nervous, and I, I start to, uh, in, in all honesty, um, start getting really insecure because of the fact that I'm, uh, you know, a little inebriated and uh, really start nose diving near the end. Um, but I think this pattern gets us. But ooh, no, it doesn't. There it goes. Gets, it got us finally, but some of these weirder patterns I, I was really seeing really well. And this, and some of these faster ones, it really got me. I was like, I don't, what the fuck's happening? We got him down to a third of his health points here. We should have, we, uh, we dodged when we should have dodged. That's all I can say for that one. Yeah, we're we're kind of we're we're uh, we're in free free fall mode here, and mainly um, because we we haven't really made it this far before, and also we're in no state to uh, adapt to a new surrounding. That's kind of how that works. Um, we are, but two hits left. A little achievement there for holding this lock on attack for eight years. Down to our last hit here. Oh, and that's it. You know, and and and, and we could even say, oh shit, we were. That's right. I uh, I continue on. And that's the sad thing. If we didn't just walk ourselves drunkly into that pink bullet, we could have, we could have been a contender. Another movie quote. That's that one's for you. Game bound. But yeah, I mean, hey, a two CC run. I'm not going to like jerk myself off to it. We're not, we're not settling for that. You know, overall, you know, we, we beat the game better than we did when we first bought the game. That was a 9cc run of utter humiliation. This is at least two. You know, which I'm sure we could have done in previous previous runs. But, you know, it felt good to just be like, holy fuck. We got hit one more time than we really should have. Look at her all embarrassed there. Oh. So, uh... 
we're gonna watch a little bit of the credits, I suppose. I I, I, I guess. But uh, yeah, that was uh, that was me uh, drinking too much from a bad day at work and doing too good and wishing I wasn't so drunk enough so I could actually focus and actually beat this game. We could have fucking beaten this game. As it turned out, we got hit one too many times. Just one. No, it's not, that's not even an expression. That's, that's math. One time. One time too many. We did the math and we, it was off by one. That's all it was. Yeah. So what are we gonna do? Oh, I guess we're gonna hit, hit, hit start there and do whatever. All right, guys. That's I think that's it for now. Uh, leave some comments, leave some subscriptions, and then just leave. Leave me alone. How about that? Leave.